Also breaking at this noon hour, Monroe County Schools will stay open for now. This morning, the president of the Monroe County School Board Association addressed that decision and more. Kayla Green was at the press conference and joins us live here at noon. Kayla? Mark, right now, superintendents are meeting daily and discussing what it would look like if and when schools have to close. Now, as of now, there are no cases of coronavirus in any Monroe County schools, and districts are taking guidance from the health department. The president of the superintendent's council, Thomas Putnam, says districts have canceled travel, group activities, and events of 50 or more people. He says if the time comes when a district has a case, they have to close that school for at least 24 hours. They will then identify who that person has come in contact with and make sure the building is cleaned and disinfected. Putnam says if a school were to close, they each have a plan to handle online instruction based on their individual district capabilities. Although several local colleges have closed, Putnam says closing a K-12 school is very different and includes factors like child care. Putnam says he would advise parents to make sure their contact information is correct in the district database and to have a plan in place. I think at this point it's fair to say we don't know. So yeah, I would prepare. I am a parent. I will prepare for child care starting on Monday in case that happens. We, don't have, we have no plans now to close, but um, I think it's important for any emergency situation to be ready for. And so, yes, I would encourage parents to plan for child care as soon as Monday. He also says uh, districts are doing extra cleaning of both the buildings and the buses, both during the day and after school. And they also are working on plans for students who rely on the schools for food to make sure that if schools were to close, they would still have access to those meals. Live in Penfield, Kayla Green, News 8. Significant update this morning. Kayla, thank you. We did learn today as well, McQuaid Jesuit will close on Monday to train faculty for online course preparation there.